Nursing school looks a whole lot different in the 21st century, and there's a huge need for nurses. So we are showing you some of the training that you can get done at Provo College. We are looking specifically for nurses, those acute care nurses. So here to talk to me about it today is Doran. Doran, hi, and all your students are here as well. We'll show the training in a second. But first things first, tell us about you guys and the training you do. So here at Provo College, we do... We have a huge need for nursing, and so we need our students to step up and really be ready for acute care nursing. So we train them in all sorts of different types of modalities and training and learning. Specifically here in this virtual reality lab, we train them on their clinical judgment skills. We also work on their skills labs. We work on their simulation labs. We get them in the clinical setting so they can get familiar with their patients and what they need to do. And when we say acute care nurse, mm -hmm. that means somebody that's going into the emergency rooms and things like that, correct? Correct. So emergency room, ICU, labor and delivery, even flying for different companies and so forth in Utah. There's a huge demand for that training and for that critical thinking. Yeah, absolutely. And you can get some really cool hands-on, unique training here at Provo College. So I want to start over here with Miss Allison. Allison, how are you? And student, and you've been here for how long? Um, I'm in my third year, okay. final year. Okay. Yep. So tell us about the virtual reality lab and what you're doing right now. So virtual reality, it's just another way for us to interact with patients mm -hmm. and know the steps on how to care for patients and many different scenarios. So I'm working with my my classmate here. He's in the virtual reality class and I'm able to see what he's doing. I'm able to prompt him. I'm able, able to be the patient and ask him questions. And so when you say prompt, you're you're putting in what that patient is saying to him. Yeah. I can we can we hear it? Yeah. Okay. Can I give you the full name and date of birth? My name is Aaron Clark. Wow. My birthday is July thirty first. Thank you. Wow, Riley, how's it, how's it going? <laughs> uh, pretty good. Good. So you're you're doing the training through VR. Yeah. Did you ever think this would happen? <laughs> uh, not when I started. No. No, but pretty cool. But this is a very unique thing uh, that that Provo College has. And I mean, obviously, we just saw Aaron Clark, and he's one of the patients. But you have a lot of others, correct? And moms that are pregnant, things like that. Children, moms that are pregnant. This patient has COVID many different scenarios that we run through and we actually go through the actual steps that we would in a hospital and so it's just another way for us to get inside the 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 room without being in the room yeah very very cool well you guys i i seriously had no idea you could do this so it's pretty cool to see and miss brooke hello and you've been here for how long at the college i'm in, i'm in my the third year as well awesome. okay. mm -hmm. so tell us i mean you obviously were in the vr lab but you guys also have a different lab that you guys do some learning in Yes, the lab next door offers um, like patients one on one the actual real life room, and it gives you the experience that you were in the room, and it has all the right equipment to be able to use your hands, use your fingertips, to be get in the action and get comfortable, and to utilize the skills and education that they have taught. It really gives you a bedside manner, yeah. along with and along with the education, it offers you the stepping stone to be able to go into nursing with comfort. And your teachers are watching through the window so that they can help guide you or coach you after yeah. correct throughout every step they have never left our side and they offer counseling and everything through everything to make sure we are comfortable yeah. when we leave this place well wow, you guys definitely are doing some good work and we also need you so we got to say thanks to these guys so yeah. Dorn, if there are other people out there watching who want to become a nurse uh, how can they get a hold of you guys so yeah come to our Provo College website and we have open houses that are posted on the website throughout the year where we love to come and talk to you guys a program our focus is on the students we want to help them become good nurses and really train to what they need to do so yeah. please come we'd love to have you and they'll get an experience that they won't get at other places here correct yes we offer a lot of clinical judgment training good. that's really our focus and no matter where they come from, what their background is, we'd love to train them and bring them what they need to do. Awesome. Well, team, thank you so much. I learned a lot. I had no idea about, you know, so much of this. So thank you. Thank you.